All right, so today I'm cloning a uh, ME 2.8 ECM Mercedes-Benz. I believe this is from a 2003 E500. So I'm just going to open the original up, take off the uh, immobilizer chip, and get the data from that chip and write it to the immobilizer chip on this one here. Okay, so I'm gonna get these open. Okay, so I got the original open. Uh, this back, this is the back of the uh, of the ECU. When you remove the screws, it's the front plate that comes off. Uh, but then I've got to uh, so this is the front of the ECU, and then you just pry the back plate off it's just uh, it's just got some glue or it's like heat sink material kind of feels like heat sink material this is it here you can see a, a burn mark on the inside of the original ECU right there and that corresponds with that spot right there the board burned right there. You can see from the front. Right through there, you can see some burning of the board. So once you pry the back off, you'll find the immobilizer chip lives right here. I've already removed it. I just took a uh, rework station, heated it up, and uh, removed the chip. This is the original, so I'm not worried about cleaning this up. I'll probably just use this for spare parts. Okay, so there's a little chip I removed. That's the immobilizer chip. So I'm going to be taking this chip here and I'm going to read the data, save the data, and then take the same chip from the donor and write the data from the original onto the donor. Okay, so I've set the chip inside my VVDI prog programmer, and you can get a look at it through the microscope here. Sits right in that little adapter. You can see the adapter there, it's upside down. It's S0P16 adapter for VVDI prog. And I got my little chip sitting in there already. It's right there. Now we're gonna read it. We're gonna read it, we're gonna save it, and then we're gonna do the same thing, uh, remove the uh, immobilizer chip from the donor, and read that one, save that one, erase that one, and then write the original to the donor. Okay, we're about ready to read this. I'm going to put up BVDI prog so that you can see what I'm doing. Okay, there's prog. Now I go to EEPROM brand ST, and this is the chip number. You can read this chip number off of the chip itself. Okay, and now I'm just going to read it. Okay, and there it is. I save this data. Okay, so I've got this data saved now. Now I'm going to remove the immobilizer chip from the donor and do the exact same thing. I'm going to read it, save it, and then erase it. So I'll, uh, I'll show you that part while I erase it and then write the original data onto it, okay? Okay, so I've got the new chip or the used chip in the VVDI prog now. Let's go back to VVDI. 
Let's read this. Okay. Now let's go ahead and erase it. Operation success. Okay, that's erased. Let's read it now. It should be blank now. Let's read it again. And yeah, we got all Fs. That's a blank chip. Now we're going to open our original. This is the original, and now I'm going to write the original. You click on write. It'll pop up asking me if I want to continue write. Yes. Here we go. We're writing. Okay, we're done writing the original to the donor chip. Now I'm just going to resolder this onto the donor ECU and it's going to be plug and play for my customer. If you need an ME 2.8 ECU cloned, I can do that for you. Get in contact with me. My contact details are in the description. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.